Hey, what's going on? Jesse Dale, the Natural Missionary, and reading the book, or actually rereading the book, uh, Seven Habits of Highly Effective Leaders. If you've ever read it, drop a one in the comments, and we'll be reader readers and together and really have a bonding moment. Uh, but anyway, one of the concepts of that book is the win win concept. And I see a lot of people with really good hearts that are playing a, win, a lose win battle, which equals out to be a lose-lose. So let me explain what I'm talking about. I see a lot of people, particularly in the fitness industry and the nutrition industry, who are saying, you know what, I can't invest into me. I can't do, take time to meal plan or go work out and, you know, that's selfish. I've got to put my energy and resources into those around me. And that sounds very much, that, that sounds really nice. It sounds like, uh, it's a lose win. You're saying, I'm going to be selfless. I'm going to lose. So you win. It sounds very noble, actually. Um, and at face value, it's like, hey, high five, man. That is a really noble way to, to think. However, what ends up happening when you play the lose win game is it becomes a lose lose. So what am I talking about? How can, how can putting those around you before yourself, how can that ever be a lose lose? How can it be a lose? I, I can understand maybe it's a little bit of a loss for you, but how can it be a lose for them? Well, because here's the thing, when you don't think win win or you think lose win, okay, you're losing, so now you're building up resentment, you're, you're not growing at all. So let's just, uh, get, let's just take this home into the wide world of nutrition. So say you're like, you know what, I'm not gonna take the time to invest in my health, to do the nutrition I need to do, to do the meal planning. Okay, what's gonna be the result of that? The result's gonna be lower energy, lower self-esteem, you look in the mirror, you see some things that you don't wanna see, you know, your, your energy is sluggish, and now, who's losing? Now remember, you already admit it. You, you're already cool losing, okay? Because you're trying to selflessly give to others. But now, think, think bigger picture. Who's ultimately losing? Are they getting the best of you when you're looking in the mirror and you're like, ah, or you're, you know, you're not fueling yourself right, or you're not meal prepping right, or you're not investing into yourself? They're the end people that end up losing. When I say them, I mean the people that, that you're, give, you're sacrificing yourself for to, to help, they end up losing. And now it's a lose-lose. So now that lose-win that you originally signed up for became a lose-lose because they're not getting your best and you want them to have your best. So let's, let's talk about what a win-win looks like. A win-win looks like, you know what? You are gonna get the very best of me. You're gonna get a dad who has abundant energy, who's proud of himself, and who leads by example. And yeah, that might mean that I go to the gym a half hour uh, a couple times a week, you know? Um, that might mean that I take a little bit of time for myself because I know that a little bit of time put into myself is gonna pay off tenfold back into you. Okay, that's the win-win. So when you invest in your health and you invest in you having abundant energy and you invest in you becoming stronger, who gets the, be the, the, the best of that? Well, of course, you're thinking win-win. Those around you get the best. So, uh, you know, just, just some good perspective because I see a lot of people playing the lose win game, the lose win game, and that ultimately graduates into a lose lose game, and none of us want that. So this is just a little bit of extra perspective. Of course, you gotta keep things in, in overall perspective. You can't say, you know what, dad's gonna invest three hours a day into working out and, and go post nothing but, you know, selfies all about him, him, him. Well, that's a, that's a win lose. <laughs> none of us are playing the win lose game, okay? But just remember, the larger your cup, the fuller your cup is, obviously, if you're watching this, you're a good-hearted human being. So think of good-hearted human beings. What do they do when they have an abundant, filled cup? They go and they, they fill up as many cups as, as, as they can. They go out there and they're, they're filling this person's energy cup up and this person's self-esteem cup up and, and, and filling up as many cups as they humanly possibly can. And that's you. And that's why you want to play the win-win game. So invest in yourself. Invest in your health. Grow your energy. Grow your confidence. 
invest in yourself because you know what you're gonna do with that investment. It's gonna compound. You're just gonna put it right back into your family community, your community around here, maybe your church community. It's gonna go right back into them. All right, rock and roll. Hopefully this made sense and we're now willing to think next time we think lose win, maybe we do a little bit of a compromise. Maybe we don't do the full hour workout or, or, or you know, you know, hours of meal prepping, but maybe we say, you know what, I'm gonna think win-win here. I'm gonna do a little bit of that, do a little bit of a compromise so that we can all win in the long run. All right, rock and roll, you guys have an awesome day.